Okay, you guys, let's install our pixel on our pages here. So um, we have our opt-in page, we have our thank you page, we have a call confirm page. So um, it's the same for all pages. Let me show you how to do it on the opt-in page here. I'm gonna click on the three dots. I'm gonna go to edit. I'm gonna click on edit. And if you're using Kartra, you know, you guys, obviously you have my full blown support um, as far as training and teaching you guys how to how to, how to navigate and, and use it. Um, but if you're using any other type of landing page software, click funnels or or um or bomb bomb there's so many different platforms out there right it's all the same all you want to do is go into the settings and in this case with karcher it's right here to the left settings and then i want to go to tracking code so whatever software you're using they're all pretty much similar you should find settings you should find tracking code and then in the tracking code there's many different forms of of code that i can that i can that i can um integrate so on the Kartra side, I'm going to simply just scroll down and right here at the bottom, embed Facebook ads tracking code. That is the Facebook pixel. It's that simple. So now as I have this open, I'm going to go to my ads manager right here in the business settings, right? So if we just come back to our, our, our bookmarks, we got business settings. We can come over here, data sources, and click on pixels. Now that will bring us over here to the pixel uh, setup. And as you can see, the red dot is, is there. And once we install the pixel code on the page, it'll turn green. So um, here, you always wanna make sure that your name is down here. So you add people, make sure your name is there. If you need to add any assets, make sure you always check this circle, add whatever you see there, go ahead and add it. And really all you're doing there is we added the ad account. So everything needs to be integrated. Everything needs to be connected, your name and also the assets. Okay, so now over here, I wanna open an events manager. Now, if you recall on our um, in our second module, when I'm taking you through the setup of all this stuff, um, we bookmarked Pixel, but we didn't, we didn't install it yet. So now what I'm gonna have you do is simply come back to your folder. We're gonna right click pixel let's delete that bookmark and we're going to rebookmark it from here okay so now as i come back here i click the blue button continue pixel setup i want meta pixel we're going to click connect we're going to install code manually we're going to copy code scroll down just a bit hit continue and then we're going to make sure that all of this is blue okay and if you don't see them all blue shade that off turn it back on. If you don't see them all blue, shade it off, turn it back on. Okay, so we're shooting for everything to be blue. Okay, now continue. And all we're going to do here is continue. So we copied it already, right? We copied it. We're going to hit continue. We're going to go to pixel overview. And now here's what we're going to do. We have that pixel copied. So all we're going to do is bring it over to our cartridge page, control V, there goes my pixel. I click apply. I come up here to the actions. I publish live. And now I want to make sure that Facebook reads that pixel for the first time. So I'm going to get the page link. Now this link needs to be customized, which we're working on right now. Um, that will be your custom domain, the same one you integrated with Facebook. That is, your, is going to be the custom domain. But for now, we'll just simply grab that link open it up in a new tab and you can see right here my Facebook pixel helper which is what I want you guys to install um, this is a free plugin it simply just sits here at the top and all it does is it let it lets me know if my pixel is active it also lets me know if anybody else is pixeling me so if I'm on any random website I'll be able to click on this this thing will light up and, and it'll let me know that this person's pixeling me which I don't care. Everyone's pixeling us. You guys, no need to worry about that at all. I simply have it up here to test my pages. That's all I care about, right? So as you can see here, um, it, it lit up blue, it lit up green. I can click on it and there is my pixel. So now Facebook is reading that that page for the first time. Now, if I come over here back to the events manager, I'm going to refresh this page and now we're going to see a different view of it. So now, as I X out of this window here, I can minimize this up here in the top right. This is where our pixel is at. Okay, so now what I'm going to have you do is I'm going to have you bookmark this page right here. So this page becomes the pixel page. Okay, so this is pixel. Okay, we're, now it's in that folder as well. So we hit done. Now we have that new pixel in this folder. So there are our seven 
bookmarks. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Those are our top seven. Now, in the future, right? In the future, in fact, let me show you on this page. Um, so now that I hit publish live, I applied it to the left. I came up here, actions, I hit publish live. Now I can return to dashboard. And let's do it one more time so I can show you now where you can grab the pixel again. So now let's do it for the thank you page. So as I click on that, go into edit, and I simply come over here on the left-hand side. I'm going to click on settings. I'm going to go to tracking code, and I'm going to come down and paste it in over here. But, but I want to show you now where I grab it from this part now. So this is our new bookmark, right? So now it's going to be right here, add events. This is where your pixel is going to be at. So all I got to do is click on this dropdown, add events, and then I'm going to go from a new website, right? Not from the pixel, not any of this, from a new website, install code manually, copy code. That's it. And you can go through the rest of it, but you really don't need to because everything is already there. So just you can keep hitting continue if, if anything, but you don't really need to. As long as you copy it, you're good. Bring it over to your page, paste it in, apply, publish live, grab that link so Facebook can read it for the first time. And this is our thank you page, which again, we'll be customizing these links. So this is our thank you page. So now there goes... Andrea, shout out to Andrea um, on her thank you page. And now the pixel is installed correctly. Okay, so now I want to come back over here to Kartra, close that out, actions, return a dashboard. And that is it, you guys. That is your pixel um, installation. So now we'll move on to we'll move on to the next video, which will actually be the thank you page. So I'll see you guys there.